Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So today what I want to do is show you guys two products that I have fallen 110% in love with for the brows. And the best part is they're a drugstore. The only reason why I did try, on, try these products is because I initially wanted one, I went out and grabbed the wrong one, and then I was like, I should return it. No, let me give it a try. Tried it, loved it, but then I still kind of wanted the other one. Got that. Fell in love with it too. So, and like I said, it's drugstore, so yeah, it didn't break the bank, so that's awesome. Um, hence, that's why my brows are not done, because I'm going to go ahead and do them on camera with you guys so you can see what I'm talking about. I'm going to go ahead and do one brow first, and then we'll work on the other one, because I kind of want you guys to see the difference that these products make. I'm gonna show you guys the products. This here is the very first one, and this is the Maybelline New York Brow Precise Fiber Volumizer Mascara, and I have this one in soft brown. Now, I I will admit, I do tend to use like um, brown mascaras, but usually the clear ones, because they, they're either hit or miss. If you get a brown one, then sometimes it's too light, it's too dark, um, I don't always love the wands because the wands sometimes just have a way too much product and just make a mess out of whatever amazing, you know, brow day you may be having, right? So, um, when I grabbed this, which is not what I initially wanted, I was like, what the hell, what, what, what the hell did I get, right? And then I was like, okay, I'm gonna give it a try. And I'm actually glad that I did. So as I said, this one is in soft brown. Now I do have different tones in my hair, but in a sense it's kind of brown. Um, with a little bit of gold, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. So um, this one actually works for me. This here is what the wand looks like. So if you turn it sideways, it's flat. But if you put it on the other side, it's almost like... Looks like it, honestly, it looks like the shape of an eye in a sense. Um, and I'm not sure if you're going to be able to see this. I'll see if I can kind of zoom in and show you guys. But there are little, like, hair here, which are, like, bristles. And then you have fibers. Fibers! So, as you can imagine, not necessarily being a tinted eyebrow mascara lover, I was like, oh, God. But... It's perfect. So I'm going to go ahead and use this to do my right brow, which on your end is probably uh, my left. So I don't have to clean the brush out, take some product out, because the bristles are not very long. And I just go on in and brush specifically where I have hair. Now I do have some sparse areas, but that's where the fibers do come into play. So I literally just brush through. So you're using this mascara to kind of brush your hair down in place, but at the same time, you're adding fibers and making your brows look fuller and fluffier, um, but still very polished and clean. So many days, I literally just do this and come out the door and do what I need to do. On days that I feel like I need a little more coverage, I'll go ahead and use the next product that I'm going to show you guys. And I really do like this because on this brow here, I don't have that much hair at the beginning of the brow. And I can kind of like fake the funk with this and I like that. This is really good for on the go travel and when you're in a rush, which is usually me. Because I'm not a morning person. So this is what my brow looks like using this product and done. And this is what my natural brows look like with no product at all whatsoever. Quite a difference, right? So, the next product I want to show you guys is this brow pomade right here. This is also by Maybelline New York. This is the Brow Drama Crayon Pomade. When I heard pomade, I'm like, oh, but don't they usually have it in, like, the little pots and it's cream? So I was curious, which is why I really wanted to try it, because this is basically a chubby pencil and it does twist up which is awesome what's questionable to me which is not a deal breaker is you know if the point which is sharp at the moment 
kind of starts to fade away because you use it so often. How do you sharpen it? Because towards the end, it just becomes a very thick kind of crayon. So I don't know what that's going to look like. I guess time will tell. Um, but I do like this because it does the same job as the bra, bra pomade because that's what it is. The only thing that I would say is you have to be super careful when applying it. You can't use it like an eyeliner because it's not. It's a cream form set up in a pencil kind of style. So it, it easily glides right onto your brows. Um, it does the job that it's supposed to do. But the harder you go in, you're risking breaking this. Because again, it's more of a cream in a pencil product, right? But it's super creamy. So I'm going to, and it's waxy, and it's waxy, which I like. So I'm going to go ahead and do this brow with this product so that you can see how it applies. Hopefully you'll see how easily it glides onto your brow and, and how creamy it is. So here we go. There we go. So this is the brow. How quick was that, right? Um, so yeah, the, the thing about it is it is a thicker kind of pencil. So if you have really thin brows, it's kind of questionable whether this may or may not work for you. Um, if you have kind of like a medium kind of thickness to your brows, such as mine, or thicker, this is amazing. When using the brow pomade pencil, I would advise you go afterwards and just finish it off with a little bit of brow mascara or brow gel just so that you're setting the hair and the product in place so it's not going to move around and smudge so much throughout the day because I did notice that if I didn't do that with this, it did kind of start to feather a little bit. Not dramatically, it didn't look terrible, but still, you know, I'm trying to, this is a review video, so I'm trying to warn you guys that you should definitely set this with a brow gel or brow mascara to kind of help it stay longer throughout the day. This mascara is life. It is life. I don't even know. I am in love with it. You don't have to set it because it's everything that you need for your brows in one. Amazing. You can definitely get these products at any drugstore, online, eBay, Amazon, wherever you want. Even Walmart, I believe, sells them. So they're easy access. They're super affordable. Now, if you don't want to pay that much, go to Walmart because they're much cheaper over there uh, versus a regular drugstore. So this was my review on these two Maybelline bra products. I hope that this video kind of helped you determine whether or not you just want to go ahead and get them, if you want to give them a try, or if you agree with me because you have tried them, then um, we're on the same page, right? So I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share, and my social medias, or my other social media platforms are linked down below, so don't forget to follow me on those as well. And until um, next time, thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one.